What's up? What it is? What it do? Man, you always know we back. We back. We back. Another Red Dead Redemption video. Uh, maybe we about to go ahead and hit this mission up with Till with you. I mean, I ain't even about to do a lot of talking. We just about to get right into it. Right into it. Let's get it. I, um, I was, uh... Leaving again? Yes, just leaving. I'll see you soon. <coughs> Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. But I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Get out of here. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. Oh, well, let's not get over sentimental. Well, oh, the place is quiet. Get out of here. You go with my blessing. Thank you, Arthur. Found a friend looking for you. Mr. Morgan. Sir. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can I help you? I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances and mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time... He must want peace. Why could he possibly want to humiliate us further? Well, we got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Uh, perhaps I could make one last request. My men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. But I feel with some non-tribe members present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Will you, Arthur? It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Do it for me. Charles, I got... I've saved your life. <sighs> Do it for me. Sure. Come on. You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiation. Let's go. You really gonna pull that on us, Charles? I saved your life. Come on, Charles. I saved yours, too. I done saved his camps. But just for the fact that I like Charles and I damn sure like Rainfall, I would have did it anyway. This my horse? I'm a horse look bigger. This way. She looked taller. Have some men meeting me there. I wasn't sure if you'd be able to help. Thank you for doing this, both of you. You have already done so much. Ain't a problem. Oh, Nobody recognizes me. I had a few run-ins with the army recently. I wish we could have done more to control the situation. Dutch should not have gotten involved. My son has a mind of his own. Too much so, in fact. I <laughs> just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I doubt he can. Asking for very much. But when our people are sick and hungry, and we find our medicine and supplies are being deliberately withheld, how can we not view that as something personal? When they destroy our sacred sites, how can I convince Eagle Flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. Be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. You will be at the meeting and as one person who knows the true situation, at least. I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. I truly doubt it. Uh, before things pop off, I really hope they give me an opportunity to make sure my loadout is correct. Because I don't want to be out here naked with just two pistols and whatever else I had on me last. Which I think was nothing. Make sure I get these weapons off my horse. to let Till when he go on by this piece. Told him to get out of here. He done already told John, hey, yo, look. Look, bro. When that time come, we need to get you and yours up out of here. Throw the deuces. Because Mike and Dutch, they on some BS. My 
men up ahead. Hello. Easy. We chose the killer now. Kula with Yampi. Hilpo. Unyampi Ktelo. This way. Yeah, hitches. Okay. Good job, girl. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Yo. Yo. Hey. Okay, I'm out. Okay, I'm gonna be out here. I'm, I'm out here naked, then. That's how we rolling. Favors, Captain Munro, we come in peace. Hello again. Who are these two? They're uh, friends of my people. Hmm. Interesting looking fellows. Yeah, they won't cause any trouble. Well, I should hope not. <laughs> Listen, Mr. Um... <coughs> Chief. Yes, uh, Mr. I can't say that silly name. What is it? In English, they call me Rain's Fall. Yes, yes, I'm, uh, I'm sure they do. Starting off disrespectful. We're all Americans here, and we want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, Ooh, I'm yeah. confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. <gasps> Keep breaking peace treaties we've made causing disturbances in everybody's lives but I pride myself on being a gentleman really I do but there are limits so let me be very are you okay man someone Jackson take him away where was I you're a gentleman with limits are you being facetious sir come this way buddy I said, are you being facetious, Captain Monroe? No, sir, I am not. Chief Rains. That's, uh, <gasps> Rains' fault. Exactly. Chief Rains, the thing it's quite is, a cough. The federal government sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. I'll, I'll be fine. Thank you. No, no. You know he's going to have Monroe court-martialed. Or attempt to he's going to make a disgrace of him monroe seems likable enough for a west pointer why you know what favors is like because he thinks it's right because he thinks monroe oh, can i peek at or a spy he's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen he thinks monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the indians so he removes monroe but removes how Favors wants him tried for treason and hanged. Why does Favors care about the Indians? Because he doesn't want to back down. I mean, his whole professional life. We know what they say about him. High tail Favors. The man who missed a battle. Poor Monroe. Kind of liked him. I know. Well, still, he's kind of stuck up. Been appointed to negotiate. Feeling better? Yeah. Come on. <coughs> Let's go. <coughs> the lands you currently occupy belong to the United States government. Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <gasps> so? I'm afraid the federal government was quite clear, Colonel. That it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Oh, is that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. 
You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Gross insubordination. Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Let him go. This is all getting out of hand. Hi, Captain Monroe. Let's get out of here. Hi, if I... I were you, I'd keep my mouth shut, amigo. I don't want to kill this man, but shall. <coughs> Charles, Captain Monroe, mount up now. We're getting out of here. Yo, take a shot at me. Oh. Let's let him go, okay? Dude, don't be dumb. Open fire. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, I'm getting hit. Yo, they coming after us? Yep, there they come. Let me get the rifle out. Come on, shoot the kill. Oh, damn. Hey, please hold your fire. I'm gonna enjoy seeing you die, Monroe. Hold your fire. Monroe, they ain't playing by your rules, bro. You ain't figuring this out. Oh, shit. Get your ass up, man. I should have got my other weapons off. Oh, this might not be too good for me. When you shoot, I can't do it. They're trying to kill you. I swore it over. Pete the head out. Pete the head out. Oh, took my kill. All right, Charles, man. You're getting a little overzealous, bro. Let me shine out here. I, I really admit, I think Charles might be a better shot than me. Ooh, in your eye. You ain't see that coming. Just wound them then. Oh, damn. They done brought a whole... What the hell up? That's all I'm talking about. Maybe you don't get the damn dynamite out. Might succeed. What's this other gun? Oh, the Lancaster. Let's try that. How did this go so wrong? Oh, fuck it. Took out the whole. We gonna take out the whole regiment, ain't it? Y'all can't take out three men. One of them ain't even shooting, boy. How y'all won any wars? It's beyond me. I blame your colonel. He garbage just like y'all. I don't even want to kill the helpless horse. What the hell? I couldn't pass up not shooting that deer.
fast. Take you to the station. I can't believe that just happened. I've been an army man my whole life. I heard them talking. They was gonna have you hang for treason. You can't die for those fools. And what about the chief? We'll do what we can. I... Guess I won't be submitting my report. I wouldn't think so. <clears throat> Alright, man, get the hell off my horse. Get up on that train, man. Captain Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. Here. Here's some money. You take it and get out of here and start a new life somewhere. I hear Tahiti's nice. Thank you. <laughs> Just hop on a train of sand and <laughs> jump on a boat. We'll avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. <laughs> Yeah, you don't want to go to Guam. Mr. Morgan! <clears throat> are you okay? Nope. Well, never better. What are you doing here? Well, I'm on my way down to Mexico. They're finally sending me on a mission. Uh. Brother Dorkins is very jealous. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? I'm, uh, uh, I'm dying, sister. Okay. Yeah, I got TB. I got it. Beating a man to death <clears throat> for a few bucks. I've lived a bad life, sister. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. We all sin. But I know you. <laughs> you don't know me. Forgive me, but that's the problem. You don't know you. What do you mean? I don't know, but <laughs> whenever we happen to meet, you're always helping people and smiling. I had a son. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy... Well, I watched him die. And it weren't soon enough. My husband died a long time ago. Life is full of pain. But there is also love and beauty. Uh, what am I gonna do now? Be grateful that for the first time, you see your life clearly. <laughs> sure. Perhaps you could help somebody. Helping makes you really happy. <sighs> but I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often, neither do I. <laughs> but then I meet someone like you, and everything makes sense. Elaborate. You're too smart for me, sister. <laughs> I guess I... I'm afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Morgan. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. All aboard! I shall try. I know you will. Goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Sister. Ironically, this will probably be the last time you see the sister Arthur. Uh, this might be the last time you see Arthur and the sister. That goodbye is probably his final goodbye. Alright. Ooh, what was that? Something just happened. 
Something just blew off, probably. I don't know. I ain't sure. It doesn't matter. We got a new mission. We still got the mission to do with, uh, who's this? Oh, yeah, I don't really care about doing that. Who is this? Oh, something with Sadie. All right. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do this mission with uh, Sadie. Because uh, once I do this mission right here, shit going to pop off. I already know. I'm glad I did everything else before I did this one. Because it looks like whatever going to happen, war between Eagle Fly's people. Well, not Eagle Fly. That's the son. That's the one I got to do the mission with, with Dutch and them. But uh, Rainfall... Chief and this Colonel dude, they they gonna go to heads anyway. So I like them a little side stuff first. All those extra missions first. Shed a little bit more light on the situation. And I can go into that mission. So I kind of now I just wanna I I really just wanna mess the the other dude up now. I mean the Colonel he he ain't trustworthy. He kind of like Micah and Dutch. He need to be taken out. I don't know if we're going to take him out, but we can just rub whatever you got going on for the time being. We're going to war. First, we're going to check out and see what Sadie Adler want. And hopefully no bounty hunters, wolves, or any other gang trying to take me out on this road. In the last few videos, uh, all things been having no dreams or sightings of a deer no more. I don't know what's up with that. I know we're close to death and everything. I know that's supposed to have a significant meaning behind it. But for him to be seeing it a lot and then now not really seeing it at all, after certain events, like what just happened, him talking to the sister and all that, I feel like that would have been a perfect moment. For him to have a vision of that deer or lamb or whatever type of animal it is. It's a deer. Uh, but it didn't. And I haven't seen it for like the past couple of missions. So. Are you still looking for Gav? Man, you made a way out here. Hello, mister. Please, tell me you've seen Gavin. I don't even know what he looks like. Big bloke. Cockney. Londoner. Hilarious. <laughs> oh, we've had such times, me and Gav. <laughs> Nope, sorry. I've yet to meet any hilarious Londoners. <laughs> oh, he's the best. Gavin! Come on, my girl. Like, do we have a meet Gavin? I, I really want to know at this point. Worried. Is Gavin dead? Gav! Is Gavin a serial killer? Gav! Like, now nah, I really want to find Gavin. Gav! I think you should check achievement on her. Our slow mo guys. Oh, 
Oh, I'm near the camp. I'm about to say, I got my own little gang. She got her own little gang now. They go Charles. Sadie. You okay? <laughs> no. Ask that dumbass question. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? Oh, goddamn place full of people bickering, fighting, and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them of Driscoll's. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw Colm swing. I, I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me, and to my husband? Look, you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. I'll tell you what, I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail? Jack? John? Make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... But how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean it. Help them escape when I... You know, you and me... We're more ghosts than people. But them... They, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now, or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? Thanks, Arthur. Get this shit done, Sadie. I'm always down. Let's go. <clears throat> Tried to make me say it. When the time, when I kick the bucket, when I drop for good, when my eyes stay closed. Oh, damn. Okay, we here. Hey. Hey. What's going on? I think there's a bunch of them in there, mostly drunk. One of them is a fat fella with a beard. Him, he's mine. All right, fat fella with a beard, yours. How got we you. We're just going in. Where my horse? Can I get my own weapons? Okay, then. Nope, I'll use this. I don't think I had a gun like this before. I can't change my weapon. Oh, okay, I was about to say. Ooh, and I got some dynamite. Run down. Lots of folk there. But spread pretty thin. I'll set it off, and then we'll... We'll take it from there. I'm just throwing there. dynamites. Okay. So, no real plan then? Oh, I got a plan. What's your plan? I know that woman. She was with Dutch. That ain't no damn plan. You, that's how you set it off? I kind of like this repeater right here. Nope, you ain't running. Gotta flank him. Look at that. He's dead. I know he dead. I killed him. It's over now. If only we can flank him, girl, I got my sharpshooter skills on point. Need to flank. <laughs> I don't think she killed, bro.
one of y'all left. Close quarters. Oh, that should have killed him. Go ahead and drop one time. Oh, you gonna run up on me? You just going into the farmhouse? I thought you was already in there. Upstairs. Shoot, if we ever move again, I don't, I don't think we're gonna move again. But if we ever moved again, need to move the camp again. I think this would be a nice little spot right here. Stabbed him in the chest and the throat. I couldn't really see. You okay? Yeah. He was a good man, my Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Uh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. I ain't even got that. Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh, we should get away from her. Yeah. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, I want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. <sighs> so many days. Achievement. If y'all don't mind, I'm gonna take my time and steal anything and everything I can loot from these bodies right here. It's been a minute since I just looted up. Feel for the bodies that I just helped make. Never know what you might find. Say dynamite. Yo, ain't nobody out here. Bruh. Where my damn horse said. Well, I can't even loot in peace. Cause random people seeing shit. Like, really, ain't nobody out here. We left no witnesses.
I almost just shot you. I just want you to understand that I say, hey, you know what? Maybe I need to put a bullet in this horse because obviously it don't know how not to trip over shit. Where we heading? I just ran. Oh, it's my favorite people. Whatever. Ooh, shoot. What the hell? Who is this dude? What do we do to go fishing with? I ain't even sure. You get away from the lawman right quick. We ain't wanted no more. They should be off my map now. Okay, that's what I thought. He a, he a side mission. So, yeah. There's no new mission, but going ahead and hitting that Eagle Fly one. So, let's run it. Peter, and we're gonna go with the shoddy. Ooh. I got two double barrels. I'm gonna go with this one right here because it got a car. Oh, it's in poor condition. Let's take a moment. Is both of them in poor condition? This one in poor condition, too. Oh, get the hole. Let's go. This damn bear come from yo. I'll shoot you dead now. The hell? <laughs> so, dude, draw a gun on me, and I shoot back in self defense, and I get, I, I get honor taken off of that. Whatever, man. And he shot my horse, too. Yeah, punk. Back to what I was doing. I just want to maintain. Yeah, this weapon is in very poor condition. All right, I think we good. Yeah, I don't know why I got. Oh, uh, yeah, I can't talk. I don't know why I got the uh, club symbol on it, but you gonna find out. I don't know if it's a rare gun or what, but they try. Yo, did y'all see? Yo, okay, y'all ain't see that. But hopefully y'all heard that man. A bear just ran up on me. And I had to get the hell up out of Dodge real quick. I mean, that that, that came out of nowhere. Yeah. I was legit scared. Cause all I heard was this deep roar coming from my side. And then when I realized what it was, that's when a little red dot just magically appears on the map. Oh, that's a dude with the uh, yeah, shooting challenge.
Yep. I should be close to Eagle Fly by now. I think he's just right up in his mountains. Once I finish the main game, then I think all my next videos is all going to be legendary hunts. Why he can't fly his ass where I'm at? I gotta go past Valentine and all that. Time to shoot my horse up with some dope. Alright, girl. Get the pass through Valentine. I ain't been to Valentine in a minute. $550 bounty on me in Valentine's. Well, I can't run through Valentine. I was late. Dutch, Michael, Eagle Flies, and two other dudes. So good of you to join us. What's going on? Oh, Mike ain't up. I was wrong. Cordite and integrity. It is a beautiful thing. What are y'all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fault. Huh? It surely <laughs> is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just gonna trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, and remind them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for pranks? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose a little. I need you to help me. What's your real plan, Dutch? Perfect. People will see these boys, they won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem, and we'll disappear up the river. But first, we need to trap them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. So, you're using them? No, sir. No. Never. But... It is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but their situation is real complex. We ain't helping. Sure we are. Come on, let's get this done. Boy, Dutch love weasel, bro. Okay. Hurry, Arthur. I'll plant the dynamite. You run the wire. We'll keep lookout from up here. Uh, 
I sent for some of that dynamite you and Bill commandeered in Van Horn. Good work with that, by the way. Bill played drunk. The perfect man for the job. <laughs> Since he usually always is. So, you finally got to see Colm Hanks. Yeah. After all those years, hard to believe. Oh, but it was worth the wait. See? We're tying up the loose ends, Arthur. One by one. But who else you can set a loose end, no Dutch? Well, I gotta be the one to hit the dynamite. Snow when they're near. They're coming now. Ah, oh, damn! Patrol's a lot larger than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> Don't worry. That's a good thing. Okay, that's the signal. Here they come. Stay low and quiet. You sure you don't want me to man that plunger, Arthur? No, I got it. Oh, remove the weight of the world from your shoulders for a minute. Like I said, we're just going to give them a bit of a scare. There they are. So how many of them will actually like die? Than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk and administer a little good old-fashioned humiliation. You're owed that, son, at the very least. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. Okay, they've passed. Put your hands up. You're surrounded. Nobody need get hurt. Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea. Put down your guns. You are making a mistake, boy. No, you're making a mistake. Put your hands up, soldier. Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? <laughs> Is that so? Now. We should move. No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends going to tuck tail and run off? Run! Excuse me? I'm getting bored of this. Your friends fired first, soldier! I could have told you that was gonna backfire. Shots. Look out. Hold your I ain't proud of that. I shot a guy in the back. Oh, he got him with the with the machete, the hatch. It's the army. It is one regiment of pastry chefs and bullies. Watch your goddamn mouth. All of you, take what you can, and then we move out. Move now. We have to move now. Search these men quickly. Then we move. This is crazy. Why aren't we getting out of here? They might have information on them that'll help our friends with their cause. No. We need anything my father can use to strengthen our case. 
I ain't sure much is gonna strengthen your case after this. Back the hell up, Dutch. We should get out of here soon, though. Yeah, y'all really done messed up now. Find anything? Yes. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. Keep looking. <gasps> well, they throwing dynamite at us. This is not what I had. What happened to my shoddy? Oh, that sucks. They changed my weapons on me. There's a dude behind me? Bro. And I just killed you, man. I just took a machete to this dude. He gonna get back up like ain't nothing happened. Let me talk to me. Take out the damn can. I like how I shot this man head, and all I did was take off a hat. Peter. Damn. Now that's uh, reinforcements. We need to leave. But where's Peter? Was he killed? He's alive. Well, that went just about according to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me. I'm just. I'm worried about folk. I know. I. We should go. Where's he can fly? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area is gonna be crawling with soldiers in a few Yeah, soldiers, man, they shooting cannons at us from the fort. What about eagle flies? We gotta go, Arthur. Come on! We need to ride hard. Stay with me. Another one of Dutch plans failed. Left here, into the trees. What are you doing? Okay, let's dismount here. We won't get the horses down this path. All right, let's carry on by foot. Try and sell them a little snake oil. You think? It's all I got. Get out of here. Let's see if we can lose them down here. It's a dumbass plan, Dutch. I guess not. Get behind something, Arthur. I'm going to get behind you. See when them bullets hit you instead of hitting me. No dud, just where it begins, cause they wasn't even bothering us through this whole thing. We ain't had an army on our ass, and now we do. Damn. Let's see if there's a way out through here. Bro, where are all y'all coming from? Where your horse and get it, man? Don't run up on me like that. Let's keep going. Follow the path. He's got to spin us out somewhere. Behind us. Hold them off. Made a big
I'm gonna accidentally fall my ass off this cliff. I go as far as I wanted it to go. Dutch leaving me. up and come here put your hands up hello captain keep your hands up and come here come here yeah we about to go for a swim we can't do that your man those men they killed they were good men You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here! Ask my friend. Here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that. Now, it's a waste. You can't fight nature, Captain. You can't fight change. You can't fight. Gravity. That gravity was the uh that was the go to hit go ahead. That was the key word, that was the password. That what you went with. That was the signal. Oh, I'm getting some Tomb Raider vibes right here. Flies must have been taken. Taken or killed. Well, we can't go find out. No, not now. Charles, I'll, we'll send them. Where is it? <coughs> He's probably back at camp. Let's split up. I'll go tell him. You rest up, then go meet him up at the reservation. We are going to make it, brother. I can feel it. Faith Arthur. Have faith. Not in you, Dutch. Not in you. Oh. Speaking of the deer. Now I finally see another one. Okay. Should cook something. All right, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna end this video right here. Damn, we've been, hour. we've been recording for a whole hour. We got a lot done though, and uh, we running down. I think, uh, yeah, we only got a few. I think we only got a few more to go for. We are done with this story. So, I'm gonna go head end it right here i got things to do until the next video i will catch y'all later go ahead 
like, subscribe, and notification button, and all that good stuff, so you know when I post up new Red Dead Redemption videos. Also, I'm playing Kingdom Hearts, and I'm streaming Jump Force on Twitch. Uh, so whenever I do Jump Force, streaming on Twitch, then I'll put it up on uh, YouTube. So make sure you go to Twitch. Hit me up on that too. Till then, I'm out. <laughs>